Hello guys, welcome back to today's CV2 tutorial. Today we're teaching you how to make the teleporter gun. What you'll need is a trigger handle, SFX, get position, get forward vector, ray cast, the if chip, set position, a CV1 clamp, and a CV1 rangefinder. To start off with, you want to pull up your Maker Pen menu and select your connect tool. You want to head over to your trigger handle, the yellow pin on top next to the trigger handle, wire that to get position and to get forward vector. Now get position, the position will be start position and the get forward vector will be direction. Make the max distance something big. I'm going to be making my 99,000. There we are. You change it to your big number. Exit there. Now go to hit to the condition on the if chip. And then. Then you want to wire your target on set position to. Player on trigger handle should be down at the very bottom, a little yellow in, um, output. Should be looking like this. If you're looking like this, you've got all the chips done. From here, you want to head into tools, configure, head over to your rangefinder. The little red notch, you want to change that to 1. Don't have to worry about the green pin, or well, you can change it in 99,000 or however far you've made your um, distance. Now I want to change my distant units to meters, show laser when gadgets are hidden, turn that on. And we want to change the colour. You don't have to, but I like the colour Hydriana. This makes it look a bit cool. So nature is have a random laser heading up in the air currently. You want to head over to your trigger handle and unfreeze it if yours is frozen like mine is. Bring your rangefinder over directly on top of the trigger handle. Then you want to rotate it so it's pointing the way the trigger handle will be pointing. My scenario, it'll be pointing that way. Make sure the trigger handle is in the direct middle of the rangefinder. Might take a bit to line it up. There we are, line mine up. Now See how the top of my trigger handle is breaking out? You want to make it so you cannot see that. Then you want to bring your clamp over. Bring that down. Get the top yellow pin, wire that to the rangefinder, and the body, wire that to the trigger handle. So now you should have a fully functioning Blue team scores. Blue team scores. teleporting gun. But I recommend changing the sound effects. Press configure tool, sound effects, chip. Click that, head into sounds, and you can change it. I'll change mine to beep for the sake of this video. So now whenever you, whenever you teleport, it'll make a beeping sound. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share the video. Huge shout out to Captain Pearl. And that's it for today's video. Suggestions down in the comments for any kind of video, tutorials, memes, stereotypes, whatever you think will be funny. So, yeah.